Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So for today's video, we are going to be doing a little get ready with me. Um, so I took a shower already and I blow dried my hair. I kind of strained it a little bit. So I'm just going to really get ready and just do my makeup. I'm not going to do something crazy. I'm just going to do something nice and simple because I'm not going anywhere today. So we are all in quarantine. We're going to stay home. And yeah, so I'm just going to quickly get started and just kind of chit chat with you guys a little bit of what's been going on with me. And yeah, pretty much. Alright, so first, I'm just going to go ahead and spritz my face with this Kopari Coconut Rose Toner, which I've really been enjoying lately. So I'm just going to spray my face really quickly. Just kind of let that sit in. So, um, pretty much a lot of you guys already know, but some of you guys might not know because you guys are new to my channel, but I do have a daughter. Um, last year, actually, yeah. So I was doing YouTube for like a while already and I kind of stopped because I got pregnant with my daughter in March of 2019 and I just kind of decided to take a break from YouTube and just really enjoy my pregnancy, try to take care of me because previous to that I did have a miscarriage and I mentioned in one of my previous videos on the video of like where was I and I got pregnant and stuff like that, I will link it down here if you guys want to watch it or up here um i pretty much wanted to take a break from youtube because it was kind of stressful and at the time i was working full time so doing youtube was kind of like my part-time hobby type thing but once i found out i was pregnant i kind of just wanted to take the time and like relax and enjoy my pregnancy and really take care of myself so that is pretty much what i did and I've been wanting to do YouTube again for so long, but it's been really, really hard. Like, I don't know how so many moms, like, manage to do YouTube full-time. I'm guessing some of them actually have, like, a lot of support. Like, I don't know, maybe they have babysitters or they get support from, like, that's, like, their job. So they get support from their family members or their husbands and stuff like that. But for me, YouTube is, like, not my job. So I didn't really get that support and I just kind of decided to quit for a little while and I've been wanting to do it but again it was really really hard so I just ended up like kind of forgetting about it pretty much. By the way I applied the Clinique um, Dramatically Different Gel Moisturizer if you guys are wondering and then next I'm going to do the Catrice Prime and Fine um, Smoothing Primer. I'm just going to go ahead and take a little dab and then just apply everywhere on my face and so yeah you guys basically I just kind of took a break and I've been really wanting to do YouTube for a while now but it again it's like been so hard like filming taking care of like a baby and being a housewife like taking care of like a lot of house stuff like chores and you know cooking and taking care of like basically your baby yourself and your husband in the house and a dog it's just a lot and doing YouTube was just like too much for me but now that my daughter is older she's already one and a month like it's been a little bit easier for me to kind of squeeze YouTube videos here and there because she's a little bit more calm and she takes her naps really well because she wasn't really a good napper um, so now she takes really good naps sometimes so she allows me to do YouTube sometimes I'm using the Fit Me foundation and the Dewy Smooth. I'm in the shade 220 if you guys are wondering. So that is basically what has been going on. And that is why I kind of like came back to YouTube because I really like missed it. Um, but right now it's really hard you guys. So I'm going to throw the beans at you right now. You guys don't know this but I'm actually pregnant again with my second baby I know it's crazy like I was gonna do a separate video on this but you know what I might as well tell you guys everything on this video because it's like a chit chat get ready with me and I want you guys to get to know me a lot more and like what you know what's going on with me basically so I am pregnant um I'm currently three months and one week right now so I am 13 weeks and I don't know what I'm having yet, so that is kind of, um, you know, exciting to me. But, like, me and my husband decided, like, ever since we knew we were going to start a family, 
like I knew I wanted to have my babies right away like because I want them to grow up together and like be best friends and be there for each other and like just grow up because I like in my family household there's like in there's five of us in total so my parents had two boys and three girls but my older sisters like they're really old like I mean they're not like super old but they like the sister before me we we're like 11 years apart and here's a little story backstory because my parents actually were planning on just having three kids so they had my older sister then they had my brother and then they had my sister and then that's kind of like them you know they didn't want to have more kids but my sister the one before me she really wanted like a sibling like a lot a younger sibling so she really like was pushing my parents to have another baby and ta-da i came to the world so my parents decided to decided to have me and then they had my younger brother which was perfect they had my younger brother um like two years two years apart and me and my brother are like this like super super close even though we're like two years apart and he's a he's a male like i'm a female like we grew up telling each other secrets like everything like we just grew up loving each other and like i get my older siblings like i get them and stuff like that but there's no other bond than me and my brother like i know there's things that i could tell my sisters that i wouldn't be able to tell him just because he's a man but like i don't know there's still like that connection like that bond so it was just like really great to have like a very close brother so right now i'm actually using the elf 16 hour camel concealer i'm using two shades because the first time i got this shade it was so light on me and then I picked this one up this one up and it was just like way too dark for me so I'm gonna be mixing this two together as you guys can see it's like super light so I'm just gonna apply a little bit of this and then apply more by the way I have like an Ulta bag sitting over there which I've been wanting to do an Ulta haul pretty soon and, and I can't wait to use it I have to do it very quickly because I seriously need to use some stuff from there so i need to get it together so i'm just gonna let my um concealer sit a little bit i'm just gonna do my brows really quick i'm using the l'oreal um, brow stylist shape and fill this is in the shade brunette so that's what i'm gonna do and so anyways so me and my husband kind of decided that we wanted to have our kids like back to back so i was like okay we're gonna go ahead and start trying once my daughter hits one but we ended up sorry start we ended up ugh, we ended up starting to try a little bit sooner because I honestly you guys I didn't even think we were gonna get pregnant this fast. Well little did you know it only took us like I don't know it only took us like two months to try and bam I was pregnant. So it wasn't like a total surprise for me because we were already kind of like wanting to get pregnant, but um I don't know i'm very nervous about having two babies at the same time like you know my daughter's pretty much already a toddler but having another baby and then like a toddler like it is crazy like that is gonna be just insane and my daughter you guys she's a handful she's like super super energetic already so thinking about having another baby like is just it blows my mind so i'm gonna be super busy i really really want to do youtube like a lot because i don't know i like it i feel like it's such a good de-stressor and i don't know i just feel like i like it and i don't know who knows what um the future will hold for me but um i really like sitting down and talking to you guys and interacting with you guys on the internet i just think it's so amazing and it's so cool to you know just talk to people from all around the world and get to know everybody and just like it's crazy how like one thing the love of makeup can bring so many people um together in this world full of like darkness you, you know what i mean so um yeah so that's basically i feel like youtube is kind of like my escape like i just love it i love to relax i love to do my makeup and i like just to talk to you guys so we will see 
I really want to focus on YouTube and like I really want to not quit on it. So um, I really, really hope I can back my word and stick to my plan um, once the other baby comes. I know it's going to be super hard, but um, I have an agenda, you guys. I actually bought an agenda a couple of months ago and that is why I've been kind of like back to YouTube because I kind of made myself a schedule of like, okay, these days I'm going to do YouTube like I have to make YouTube like my priority and then on these days I'm going to clean my house, I'm going to like, you know, do laundry and then we're going to like hang out with the baby and go for a walk and stuff like that, you know. So I have like my agenda all planned out and I feel like that's been working so good for me. So I like it so far and yeah, but we can go ahead and talk talk more about that in the future but hopefully i can do it because it's it's really hard you guys it's really hard when you're like a full-time mom and you have like a house to keep up with my house is like not little that's what i'm saying like i wonder like how these like big youtubers do it with like like you know they have kids and they're like cleaning their house doing youtube like so much like during the week it's just it's just insane to me, but I'm, I'm sure, like, you know, they manage because it's their full-time job and they have, like, a lot of support and stuff like that. So, I get it. Um, so, we will see how that goes. So, next, I'm going to take my Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder. This is in the shade Fair. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's in the shade Fair. And I'm just going to go ahead and get my brush this is a luxie 660 precision brush it's like a precision foundation brush but i use it for powder so because i feel like it fits like right there like perfectly under the eye so i like that so anyways that is pretty much what is going on with me so i spill the beans i'm pregnant again <laughs> um but yeah so i am actually currently not working at the moment, um, I stopped working due to COVID. Um, I just, I don't know, I just decided like, you know, taking care of my baby is much more important than being at work, being stressed out, and just, you know, money, pretty much. Like, I just felt like I needed to be with her, especially during these hard times of like uncertainty. I needed to be with her and, you know, I needed to spend time with her and raise my kids because to me my mom actually raised me and i love that and right now when i see like kids being raised by like their babysitters or by other people like it kind of makes me sad because i feel like they didn't get like that opportunity that i got and it was so fun like you know when i was a baby or when i was younger so to contour i'm just gonna use the revolution conceal and define this is in the shade c13 um, I just felt like, I don't know, I really just felt like, um, I don't know why I did that. <laughs> oh god, I don't know why I did that, you guys. See, even I make mistakes, so I'm just gonna cover it up a little bit. But anyways, I just kind of wanted to add just a tiny bit here on the sides. That's a little bit too much. Because a little bit goes a long way with this little thing. Um, so I'm going to take this Morphe brush. I've had this for so long and I'm just going to go ahead and buff that out. Um, so growing up, my mom used to always like have so much fun with us. And she used to always like teach us so many good things that when we went to school, like we were such smarty pants. And I don't know, I just felt like getting that extra love from your mom like growing up was just amazing for me and i just thank my mom and i thank my dad that she was able to take care of us and you know my dad he was always there providing for us like nothing ever um was needed from us like we we had pretty much like everything we could ever want and to me i felt like that was just something so nice and I kind of just want my daughter to have that as well because I grew up in that circumstance and I know a lot of people are not that fortunate. So I'm very, very glad and I'm very, very thankful that, you know, I I 
I'm able to do this. I'm able to stay home with my daughter and raise her and, you know, be home and, and safe and teach her everything I know and stuff like that. So, yeah, let me get actually another brush to contour my nose. So, anyways, that is pretty much what I've been doing, you guys, and what's been going on. Um, so, for eyeshadow, I'm just using the KKW collaboration with Mario palette and I'm going to do something very very natural with this makeup so I'm just going to take a brush and I'm just going to go in with this shade right here this one right here and I'm just going to go ahead and apply that on my crease area right now I actually I don't know if you guys kind of tell but I'm like in I this used to be actually like a spare room so we had this bedroom kind of like it was just like you know my studio where I would do my my um, videos and it was just like like a room for me to get ready it was like my makeup room it had like my closet and everything and then when I found out I was pregnant like this became the baby's room but of course my my bedroom is like not that big either so we had to kind of like rearrange some things so I could move like some of my clothes over there and get a dresser and stuff like that so that's what's going on and right now my desk my makeup vanity is actually here in my daughter's room and like i said on one of my previous videos i think it was like the lip declutter i said that my daughter was pretty much getting into everything right now so i ordered a new desk it's such a it's like a much smaller desk and i got it off amazon so leave a comment down below if you guys want to see us kind of like well, maybe not installing it or like putting it together because it's actually arriving today and I don't think I'll have time to do that because I think my sister might come over so I don't think I'm gonna have time to like film and everything and I am like so anxious to get it ready and get all my makeup to my bedroom already because I just need to get this situation fixed because her TV is like it needs to be mounted on this wall right here and this is where like my desk is at so I don't know I just I feel like I just need to get it ready so next I'm gonna go in with this dark brown right here this corner using the same brush and I'm just gonna go ahead pack that like right here in the corner and so I I think my desk is gonna arrive today pretty soon um, so I got off Amazon it's a really small desk hopefully it fits because me and my husband we did the measurings and everything and it's supposed to fit where i want to put it so hopefully it fits and then my vanity i actually sold it to my older sister because she really wanted a vanity so i sold it to her she's going to be taking my vanity and you know me and my husband really want to move in the future we want to like buy um like a bigger house because me and my husband actually do want like a pretty big family um I grew up in like a really big family and I just love having so many brothers and sisters like it's so fun and I just love having like that support and everything like that like that love so I mean I don't want like a huge huge family either I think maybe we'll have like three babies but right now in the house that we're living it's just like a two bedroom so two babies is already too much um, for this house so if we end up having a third one we're going to definitely have to look into selling our house and then repurchasing a different one or we can just rent this house and then get a different house somewhere um we always talk about you know moving to a different state as well so we don't know what the future holds for us um i'm just kind of like letting it be at the moment but that's kind of like what's going on like currently so i'm going to take this flat brush this is the morphe e14 and i'm just going to take this one right here it's like a really pretty gold and i'm just going to apply that on my lid and then just to make it like kind of shiny i guess um you guys lately i haven't been into lashes it's so weird like i haven't been applying lashes but again i feel like i don't need to apply lashes because like we're not going anywhere we're like in quarantine so i'm gonna try to get ready for my house you know i mean i'll get ready for my husband but I don't okay know. so i'm gonna go ahead and curl my lashes because 
my lashes are super short by the way you guys let me know in the comment section what you guys think about fake lashes like do you guys recommend them do you guys not recommend them like you know are they worth it or what because when i was actually pregnant with my daughter um like i felt like i wanted to get them like right when i was about to give birth because i just felt like i wasn't gonna do my makeup and just like having lashes since my lashes are always they've always been super short my lashes have always been super tiny so for me lashes is one of the biggest things for me and um i felt like getting my lashes done but it was too late it was too late for me to get them done i was about to like do um or make an appointment when i had to have my baby so that death didn't work out but i'm thinking about getting them done for you know when i give birth to my second baby like i feel like i just spit it um i don't know let me know in the comment section because i've heard like good things about them but then i'm kind of scared because i've seen like so many horror stories about like fake lashes like you know like sometimes they apply them wrong and they apply them to your natural lashes so you know they can fall off and then making your real lashes fall off and i'm just like that is scary because my lashes are already super super tiny and like i've always been super like i don't know just like i've never really love my lashes because they've always been super short by the way the mascara i'm using is the better sex better than sex mascara by Too faced i have like so many of these little tiny samples that i need to like use them up so that's what I'm, i've been doing i've been just using these up because i have like some new ones like the full size and this is like my favorite mascara i like love it so much because i feel like it does kind of plump my lashes a lot bigger than what they are um and i just like how it make my lashes look so but anyways, let me know in the comment section what you guys think because I really want to get them done. But I'm just like, uh, I don't know if I should. And my sister actually won a giveaway um, recently. So she got her lashes done. They look so good. They look super natural. So now I'm kind of just like intrigued and really thinking about it. Okay, guys. So for blush, I'm going to use a Too Faced a Peach, Papa Don't Peach um, blush. It's so cute. I love this. Um... I love this blush it's just like the perfect shade and I'm just gonna apply a little bit here on the apples of my cheeks and then I actually like to apply a little bit on my nose I don't know if anybody likes to do that but I do I just like that like glowy natural look so that's what I'm gonna do and then now I feel like I'm gonna do my highlighter let me go ahead and get a highlighter I haven't used this Fenty in a while okay so I'm going to use this Fenty Beauty. This is the Hustle Baby Money, Mean Money um, Duo. And I'm just going to use the Hustle Baby, which is this side right here. I'm just going to apply a little tiny bit, not a lot. Ooh, love that highlighter. Sorry about my lighting, you guys. Like I said, I'm in my daughter's room, so the lighting is not that great. Because the TV is like right here, so it's kind of like covering the natural light from the window. Um, but I cannot wait to have like my other desk come by and get here so I can film more videos for you guys in my bedroom. It'll be so nice. Um, okay. So next I'm just going to go ahead and wipe my lips. Okay. So now that my lips are ready, we're going to go ahead and apply the lip liner. I'm using this NYX lip liner in soft brown. That's the shade. Mm, and I'm just going to go ahead and apply that. All right, and then I'm just going to go ahead and apply this lipstick. This is by L'Oreal, and it's in the shade Utmost Taupe, and it's 983. That's the shade right there. I don't know if you guys can see. My camera will focus. There you go. All right, and it's just like a pretty, very pretty nude, so that's what I'm going to go for today. Okay, a very natural nude. So that is pretty much my little makeup for today it was very nice and easy and simple so um i felt like this video was just everywhere with my chit chat um but i really didn't have any questions just to go through so i just kind of wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about me just so you guys can get to know me a little bit better but 
hopefully in the near future i can do a better q a for you guys so if you guys are not following me on my instagram please go ahead and follow me there um you guys can definitely send me dms with questions and i can definitely feature them in my future videos um, it's at alexaleo07. I will link it down below if you guys are interested in following me there. I don't normally, or I haven't recently posted a lot of, actually haven't posted a post in a long time. But I do update you guys on my YouTube videos and stuff on my stories. So follow me there. Um, but yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy the video. If you have any questions, any video requests, please leave them down below. I always like to hear what you guys have to say. Um... But yeah, guys, so I kind of spilled some beans today. Literally. I told you guys that I was pregnant again. Isn't that crazy? Like, I cannot believe I'm, like, oh my god, I can't believe I'm pregnant again. That's just, that's just insane, you guys. That's insane. But anyways, um, let me know if you guys want maybe, like, a pregnancy video on my daughter. Like, how that went. Like, my labor story. Um, unfortunately, I don't have any, like, videos to show you guys or anything like that. I actually do have one, but it's a little bit too much. Like, too much. It, it's just too graphic. So, I can't show you guys that. But, um, let me know if you guys have any questions, any labor questions. I don't know. Whatever you guys want to know. But anyways, guys, that was it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and leave a comment down below. Like this video also, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.